Thank you for purchasing this Viewpoint Flat Panel TV wall mount. If you have any problems with this product, or have questions about installation, please do not return it to the store. Instead, contact customer service at 1-888-333-9952. This DVD should be used as a supplement to the instruction manual provided. Please make sure you read the manual thoroughly before installing this mount. If you have any trouble viewing this DVD, please visit viewpoint.sanus.com for an online version. Tool Check To install this product, you will need a level, a stud finder, a Phillips screwdriver, a 13 millimeter or half inch wrench, a 3 16 inch drill bit for wood stud installations, or a half inch masonry bit for concrete or concrete block installations, and an electric drill. It is also a good idea to have an awl or small nail to verify stud locations. Parts check. Check carefully to make sure there are no missing or damaged parts. Depending on your installation, you may not need every part provided. If any parts are missing or damaged, please contact customer service at 1-888-333-9952 to have the parts sent directly to you. Step 1. Attach the wall plate to the wall. Wood Stud Mounting Please note, for safe installation, any drywall or other wall covering material may not exceed 1 half inch or 13 millimeters in thickness. Use a stud sensor to locate and mark a stud. It's a good idea to verify the stud location with an all or thin nail. Taking into consideration the overall size of your TV, hold the wall plate against the wall to mark four hole locations on the stud. Two in the top row and two in the corresponding holes in the bottom row. Using the 3 16 inch drill bit, Pre-drill four holes to a depth of two and a half inches. Attach the wall plate using the four lag bolts and lag bolt washers. Use a level to ensure the wall plate is square with the wall before tightening the bolts with a wrench. Do not over tighten the bolts. Step 1-1. Concrete or concrete block mounting. Taking into consideration the overall size of your television, hold the wall plate assembly against the wall to verify the correct position for your TV. Mark six hole locations, three in the top row and three in the bottom row. Make sure the holes are not located in the mortar between the blocks. Drilling into mortar can result in property damage or personal injury. Using the half inch masonry bit, pre-drill six holes to a depth of two and a half inches. Do not drill into the mortar between the blocks. Insert the concrete anchors into the wall with the flared ends first. Make sure each anchor is seated completely flush with the concrete or concrete block surface. If there is a layer of facing material in front, it must not be greater than one half inch or 13 millimeters in thickness for your application to match the installation methods described in this video. Attach the wall plate using the six lag bolts and lag bolt washers. Use a level to ensure the wall plate is square with the wall. Tighten the bolts with a wrench until the washer is pulled firmly against the wall plate. Do not over tighten the bolts. Step two. Attach the monitor brackets to the back of a TV with a flat back and no obstructions. First, determine the diameter of the bolt your television requires. Hand thread a bolt into the insert on the back of the TV. If you encounter any resistance, stop and select another bolt diameter until you have the correct size. Thread the short bolt through the lock washer, the appropriate flat washer, the monitor bracket, and finally into the TV. Step 3. Attach the monitor brackets to the back of a TV with a curved back or an obstruction near the insert. First, determine the diameter of the bolt your television requires. Hand thread a bolt into the insert on the back of the TV. If you encounter any resistance, 
Stop and select another bolt diameter until you have the correct size. Thread the long bolt through the appropriate lock washer, flat washer, and into the monitor bracket. Add a spacer between the monitor bracket and the television. M4 and M5 bolts will require a second flat washer between the monitor bracket and the spacer. Step 4. Optional. Tighten the release straps. If the release straps are visible below the bottom of your TV, you may tighten each strap by pulling it through the stay until you reach your desired length. Step 5. Attach the TV to the wall plate. Please note, before proceeding, verify that the wall plate and monitor brackets are firmly fixed to the wall and the back of the television respectively. With the help of an assistant, hook the monitor brackets over the top of the wall plate. Slide the TV left or right on the wall plate to its final position. Gently let the bottom of the monitor brackets settle against the wall plate, making sure they lock into place. To release the locking tabs from the wall plate, simply pull down on the release straps. Finally, set the tension of the knobs on the monitor brackets. You are now free to enjoy your newly mounted flat panel television.